Carla here. Dave. With Photo Visual Eat Stuff. And today we thought we would bring you a little behind the scenes um, of planning for the photo shoot. As we just finished doing these beautiful pot pies. And as you look at those pot pies, you can see that nice golden color. It has a nice, there's varying shades of it, yellows and golds. And what I've picked out to go with it for this shoot is, this is a napkin, but I, I have a tablecloth in this soft, buttery yellow. And then I also have these placemats. And in those placemats, some people see blue, some people see green, I mean gray, excuse me. I see gray. Yeah. Um, so I see color very intensely. And what I picked up on was the trim color of the actual container for the pot pie, the little tart pie, tr um, and the ochre colors that, th that are in here. And I see blues, but I see, and I see grays in here. So what I've done is I brought out a couple of different items just to show you how easy it is to decide what you want to do for a layout. Um, let's just take this uh, just charger look. out, the two bottom chargers. You'll hand those to me. Um, here is just a nice wooden charger and it's got some distressing done and paint work done on the outer edges and so as I place wow. that on here you can immediately see how that effect goes really well with that looks really the fabrics good. really good this is another charger and it's a metal one smaller than the wow look at that the big size so basically what I've done is I've used two and I've layered it layered it so now you see the grays and the blues in here and the white trim around the outside. Wow, very nice. Okay, now my heart just wanted these plates over here to work. And I, I just love them. I like the pattern, I like the color. Um, and when I go ahead and set wow, these on here, that. you can see it does work. You can really see nice. it actually brings out, you wanna yeah. hold that yeah. this way for me? You wanna put your fingers on that right yeah. there? Sure. There, let's just lay that kind of. There you go. So there you can see how it's bringing out the blues oh, yeah. here and in here. Okay. Now I have another way to go, and that's with those. Do you want to go with the gray? With the gray. Okay. You want to pull those gray ones? Sure. I'll put those right here for you. Thank you. And I really love these because they have a kind of a natural look to them. You know, if you notice this plate, it's not exactly perfectly round. It's uneven all the way around. And I just love that. It's a handmade one. That's really cool. Thanks. And I don't think I've ever seen anything quite like that. Yeah, it's really really neat. All of yeah. the pieces that go with it, I'll show you that. Oh, right they now. are. They're there all are other pieces, and yeah. they're all wow. imperfect. And I love it. Love, love, love it. Wow. They're all in imperfect. So now, if you want to hold that up there for me, you can put it up against it. Sure. Depending upon what your eye sees, now you see the grays popping out. But this is oh, yeah. also a gray blue. Okay. So this is kind of where we're going to go. These are what we're staging right now is for the overhead shots. And the reason for that is, if you notice, our tarts they have very colorful pattern on them. But from the top, when you just look at the top of them, all you see is just the this little color. bit of golden color yeah. here. Okay. So. This is for our flat overhead shots. The camera will be up here, shooting down. There's some accessories that I pulled over there that just because we're gonna do, add to the, the pot pie a salad and some bread. And I picked up a couple of little things that have, pick up some of those nice colors in oh, there. Yeah. Now, as soon as I put this down, you're gonna realize this one's not gonna work. And you can see it just oh, doesn't. Yeah. It just doesn't work. Stands out too much. It's got huh? too much, yeah. yeah. There's too much yellow in it, not enough orange yep. in it. But this one, on the other hand, that works really well. Yeah, that looks really nice. Yeah, so we have we have our overhead pretty much set up here. In addition to that, I brought in a few other things, another metal tray. And we can use this to put the pies on, just to break it up a little bit. Oh, yeah. And I got this little tiny chopping board and I thought the bread would look great on this with a knife next to it being sliced. To that I always like to add ribbons and flowers especially with my overhead shots and so I have this one here it is very transparent 
but it is in the goldish ye yellow colors. And for just a subtle, subtle accent, that could be used. Oh, yeah. I can see. Yeah. Oh, that looks really nice. And then I also have Some this burlap. burlap. You know, the, the mix of this shot is kind of an elegant country kind of look. And the burlap will work with this as well. So I might use that. Pretty appropriate since we live in the country, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Here are just some uh, store-bought artificial flowers, but look at the color. Look at that yeah. color, and look how it works perfectly with our placemats yeah. and our pretty buttery yellow color on our tablecloth. So that's kind of going to give you an idea how I start laying things out. Everything starts here, right here on this, on this um, countertop. And from there, then I switch it over to um, the actual shooting station and go from there. Of course, once I get there, I may add or subtract items, but this gives me a basic uh, layout for how we're going to do the shoot. So for the overhead shots, you'll be sure to see this layout now. The 45 angle shots, I haven't decided which um, plates I may bring in these gorgeous blue ones again. I don't know. Got to do some brainstorming, huh? Yeah, yeah. But this will get us started. So um, we'll be back, and you'll get to see the pictures when they're all done. Thanks for joining us.